today my uh, workaway slaves and I went to town and we got pipes amongst other things mostly pipes and food this is Cleo Patrick and this is the deuce have you guys been enjoying yourselves yeah yeah. <laughs> that sounds super sincere. <laughs> no. I had to switch to this side because there's better light over here. Oh, so have you actually been enjoying yourself? Yeah, we have. Yeah, very much. Very much. Oh, good. Yeah, muscles. We've been building muscles. Building muscles. I knew they'd build muscles. What have you guys been doing to build muscles? Well, digging, and then we've been digging. Digging, making handles for pickaxes. Oh yeah, you broke the pickaxe. Yes, but I made it again. You made the handle yeah, again. I made that was actually very impressive. Yeah, and you exactly. and you got extra muscles from that. Can I see can I see your hands? The good ones. Show, show me the good hand. Oh, good oh yeah, that's the good stuff right there. Oh no, that's hand. that's the good hand. Oh, that's good I was hand. wondering where all the holes were. Oh, yeah, yeah no, good stuff. Good hand. This is a good hand. Yeah. <laughs> so I know I sometimes mention that when people come sometimes they suck. So these guys are actually super cool. So, I mean, there are also super cool people who come. Oh, uh, you guys are going to go on YouTube. That's okay, right? Yes. Oh, you need, um... Um, I, I need you to sign a waiver. <laughs> okay, so... Okay, good. <laughs> now they can't complain. <laughs> okay, so uh, I dropped those guys off, and now I'm going to tell you, really, they're kind of... <laughs> oh, wait, no, no. Okay, I have one more request. Can you guys say something in Danish? Yeah. Okay, say something for real in Danish. Okay. Not okay. not me imitating your Danish. Okay. Yeah, well, I so well you got these best time to talk about bone sauce. What did she just say? She said we've been here for two weeks and we could just really eat the best time with the bone. The katafa and sauce. Yeah, I've heard that. The katafa blagoon sauce? Potatoes and it's brown gravy. Ah, oh, very and good for you. The back of the pig with the skin, all crispy. We talk about it, our favorite uh, dish. Ah, yes. I should also admit that for like the last oh, hour, I've been having a nap here while they've been navigating with the map, which is right back here. And we are actually almost home. Well, it's amazing. I'm sorry, what was that? Amos is sleeping all the way. If you go here and work away, he's just gonna torture you. It's yeah. paddling all the way from Bugatown, all the way down here. Four hours! Four you, hours? You won't be a, four you're hours. Be a work away, you'll be a motor for this boat. <laughs> oh, so I've been sleeping for four hours. Yeah. Are you telling people that? Yeah. You're fired again. <laughs> you're fired? For the tenth time. <laughs> you're fired until you show up tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah. You're fired, get back to work! Well, tomorrow is video game day. So. Is is your fired, get back to work your favorite phrase to hear now? Yeah. Yeah. It's the common phrase now. Yeah. Like, I hear it every day. So, wait, wait. Tomorrow, what's tomorrow? Video game day. Ah, oh, what are you playing? We're playing Adventure Builders Club. I thought it was video just called game. Adventure Builder. Oh, Adventure Builder. That's what I know. But, oh, yeah. wait, wait. I need, a, I need a quick review. How is it? I think it's great. I think oh, it's good. really good. Oh, very nice. Have you played Adventure Builder as well? Oh, he let me play like five minutes. Oh, so he wouldn't even let you play. No. So it must be pretty good yeah, then. It must have been really good. I'm going to find out tomorrow because I'm going to play 30 minutes. Oh, oh yeah. very good. Yeah. Let's see about that. <laughs> Oh, I, should, I should actually talk about the pipes a little bit. So, I have these two pipes down here that fit together. The CPVC pipe was super expensive, so I was like, screw that. So, I got these two small pipes that fit together. And then I was thinking, I don't know if those are going to be strong enough. And it was hard to find two pipes that would fit together, but then I found the one and a quarter inch and a one inch schedule 40 pipe fit pretty well together so I'm probably gonna end up using these guys and don't worry these ones won't go to waste I will definitely find a use for them I should also show you how cool the top looks now check it out isn't that nice have you guys looked at the top of this how good it looks what? have you guys checked out the, how good the top of this looks
Whoa, that was good timing. So why have these two had such a great experience here and been so uh, good to have here for us? Um, they've been here for two weeks and it's been great. There are a couple qualities. Uh, one is they see new experiences as opportunities. So all the unusual things here, they, they just think, oh wow, I'm, I'm going to get to do something I've never done before. I'm going to learn something. It's a new experience. Great. And another thing is they don't get discouraged easily. So, for example, uh, we're doing some digging on an island and they came up to this big tree stump. And I decided I'm going to just let them handle the tree stump and I'm going to go work over here. <clears throat> and I told them, you guys, this is this is your tree stump. You take care of it. And the first day they said, uh, oh, we're getting this out today for sure. No problem. And anyone who's dug a tree stump out of the ground knows that it's a lot harder than it seems like it's going to be the first time. So they didn't get it out the first day. And the second day, they're like, okay, we're, we're definitely getting it, getting it out today. <clears throat> and they're digging around the sides, you know, cutting the roots. And, and then Christina broke the pickaxe handle by, you know, prying some roots. And I told them, you know, don't pry with the tools. But, you know, you kind of have to break one to really understand how to not pry with the tools. And I gave her, I didn't let them use my good one. So they broke the store-bought handle, which is kind of garbage anyway. So then they're like, oh, what do we do now? And I'm like, well, you make a handle. And they're like, what? Seriously? And uh, then they were excited. Wow, we get to make the handle? That, that's awesome. Um, so I told them to find a piece of wood like this and, you know, cut it to a little bit longer than it needs to be and then bring it over. And then, so they did that. And then I, I got a, a piece of the machete really sharp and said, you know, use, use the machete like this and carve the, the handle down. And, you know, Christina was working on it for a while. And then she said, you know, I, I feel like I'm not making any progress. And I said, well, do you want me to, you know, do it for 10 minutes and just kind of show you? And she was like, yeah. So I, you know, worked on it for 10 minutes, took off a lot of material, whittled it down part way. And she said, okay, I, I think I got it. So she took it back and over the next half an hour, hour, she whittled the, the rest of the, the handle down to the right size. So you get the, the pickaxe handle on there and made a new handle. And it was great. So they started using that. And then uh, the next day, they're like, oh, I don't know if we're going to get the stump out today, but we are going to get it. <clears throat> and just that, that attitude of like, like not being defeated is, is super important when you're, being, when you're in a place where you're being faced with challenges. And it's important in, just in life in general. So basically, they're having a great time here because they have a great attitude. And we're enjoying them being here because they have a good attitude. And uh, oh, and they're they're here through work away, which is uh, basically a deal where they work part time for food and housing. It's like the kind of vacation I would want to do, like go somewhere, do some work, get involved in something, and uh, it's not expensive because you 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 have a free place to stay and food and stuff. So anyway, they yeah, just having a, a good attitude regardless of what skills a person has. Just having a good attitude makes, makes new experiences so much better.